What's going on guys? I'm not doors coming back to another banger video. I'm in the shop right now. This is a pheasant video, episode four. This is week four. These birds are growing very quick, very fast. They're eating a lot more every day, drinking a lot more every day. They're getting to be very big and you guys will see that in a little bit. The reason why I'm in here is to show you what feed we have just switched over to. We are now using the game bird feed. It says nutritionally balanced to match the nutrition requirements of game birds for energy and body growth. So hopefully this stuff is good. Just pick it up at the local runnings. There's a pheasant on there. Mm, it's probably the best feed for them. I have no idea. Not really sure how expensive it is. I haven't picked any up yet, but I'm gonna go out to the coop now and show you guys the pheasants. As you can see, the sod is growing very quick. The door is open now so the pheasants can roam, as you can see there. There is a pheasant in here somewhere, a melanistic one. I've been saying that wrong though this entire time. It's melanist, melanistic or melanistic or melanistic, not molistic. There's an N in there. Oh, here he is right here by the ring neck. There he is right there. These things can fly very high already. They can fly very, very well. There they are up next to each other. That melanistic is a rooster. I'm not really sure what the straight run is. Look at how they get real low. That's cool how pheasants do that. Look at that one all puffed out by the door. They're growing very quick. I'm gonna take you inside and show you that setup. There it is inside the coop. As you can see, they're very, very, very big. Starting to roost up on the on the posts. Looks like we need some more feed. That looks a little low. They do eat very, very quick. We still got the two feeders in here, which is still working pretty good. But they are growing very, very quick. Look how long their tail feathers are, and they're quick little buggers too. I'm gonna try catching one for you guys here, both kinds. I'm not really sure if it'll be possible because they are very, very quick. But I'll see what I can do. All right guys, so here we go. I got a ring neck here. As you can see, they are very, very, very big. I'm almost not able to hold them with one hand anymore. So I'm gonna try to do this quick. There's this flight feathers, tail feathers. And as you can see, they're starting to kind of get the thing around their eyes, the ring. I don't think this is a rooster. Just about how I can tell I'm looking at the other ones. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. They're kind of ugly right now. But that's your ring neck pheasant. I'm gonna let them go here. My mom just said that a couple weeks ago they were molting feathers, which is Kind of weird because I didn't think baby chicks did that, but I looked it up and apparently they molt two times a year, chicks do, in early July and then the end of August. But it is late May right now and I found that a little weird. So they look very ugly right now. Hopefully when they start getting their colors they look a little bit better, but we'll have to see. I'm going to grab a melanistic now and I'll show you that. Here you go. There's the rooster characteristics, as you can see on the melanistics. That's why I think that other one isn't a rooster. But maybe it was losing it. I'm not sure. But as you can tell, these are all roosters, as you guys already know, that have been watching this. They're getting to be pretty cool. Starting to get their cool feathers on them, black feathers. They got giant feet. And they're starting to get their spurs, as you can see there. Tail feathers, pretty cool. They're a lot bigger than the other pheasants. They're definitely prettier than the straight run, but they're still pretty ugly. All right, I'm gonna let them go. I don't wanna stress these guys out too much. In the last video, we did have 25 pheasants and we did lose one. I don't know what happened, natural causes or what. I think it was just too hot in the coop. I have no idea. We did lose one. My brother just found it laying on the floor one day when he came in to water and feed them, which I thought was a little weird. No other ones died yet, so we raised the heat lamps up after they died. Hopefully that was the problem, and 
we haven't seen any other ones yet so that's good your one interesting fact for this video is pheasants can run up to eight to ten miles an hour if you think about it that is very very fast for those tiny little legs cutting through grass and stuff that's pretty fast that's why normally when you wing pheasants and you don't got a dog it's pretty hard to track them down unless they just sit down like pheasants do I'll try to show you that now it's kind of cool what they do yeah this one's already doing it as you can see it gets real low I'm trying to think like if I can't see you you can't see me but it's very cool how they do that Hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. I know I am. These pheasants are growing up very, very quick. And I can't wait to see them when they start getting their colors. Pheasants are probably my favorite wild game bird. They're just beautiful animals. But if you guys enjoy this video, make sure to smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me. It's been very blotchy lately. I just moved back from Wisconsin on the page. So hopefully I can get back to uploading two videos a week. That's my goal. Other than that, I ain't got much more for you guys. You guys know the drill. Don't forget to stab you people, and we'll see you on the next one. We out. Peace.